Hey, hello everyone. Welcome to Energy First Golf. So today in this video, as you can see, the title is that create your own swing film. What does that mean? And to be honest with to be honest with you, we already know the golf swing is three D, not two D. And ever since I've learned golf, I find that pictures doesn't really work for me.、It、means a single picture with words. I mean, it's good. It has some information, but really doesn't work for me in the long run. What I mean, what I mean by swing film is that you must create this film, this video in your mind. What does your swing feels like, looks like, like you can see yourself moving. So that's called a swing film, your own personal golf swing video. Now again. Why is that important? Because we already know a picture is worth more than a thousand words. So a video, a film, you get the picture, you get the idea. Is that it's worth more than just thousand words? Because we already know the golf swing is pretty complex. It is hard. So that's the reason why you have to create your own swing film. What is it for me? Again, basically, I do this every day. I actually. Doesn't matter what club I have, you know. I warm up now. You know, I have downtime and doing videos, and I would do this swing film. I would set up, and I play this film in my mind. I go, let me see my turn my hips and turn my core, create lower body stability, right? Torso rotation, feel the relaxation of my arms, create wrist hinging, weight transfer. Left leg pressure, posterior position, glutes, inner thigh pressure, turning the body, core motion, arm rotation, and continue the stretch. Continue the stretch, create this extension feeling, and then I just keep turning. Okay, so that was my swing film. I play that in my mind whenever I have a time to warm up to do the movement. So I'm gonna do it one more time. Where this time I'm not gonna I'm not going to talk. So I will probably do a little bit faster. There you go, and I will do that all the time, just because I want to play that in my mind. All the small areas, all the intricacies, all the sensitivities. I want to know every inch of my body, what it feels like when I swing the golf club. So that's the reason why I don't believe pictures works. You have to continuously work on motion, a motion. Motion, motion, right? Or really play those films in your mind. And again, if you have questions regarding what each part of your body is doing, if you follow our channel, we actually talked about that. You got to learn golf swing from the ground up. Means from the the foundation. You got to build foundations. So once you know how to do that feeling, and then what we want to do is make sure you train your eyes and your senses where you're not touching the ball means you're not reacting to the ball. So let's do one very slowly. I have a club right here, a three wood, right? I'm going to, I'm going to do the movement, but continuously get through the ball. I'm not going to worry about distance. I want to make sure I can turn through the ball. Let's do it. I lose balance a little bit there, which is okay. That means I was actually holding my breath. I'm gonna do it one more time. Okay. Just play that swing film.
There you go. Now remember, the ball is not going to go very far, but that's fine. But you're working on continuation. Now remember, a lot of times, most people, what you will tend to do is you will tend to do a double movement. What is a double movement? It means a lot of you will turn your body, and then when you get to here, then you will create this reaction movement. So you can see the ball actually went to the right. So let me do one more. So basically, we need you to understand there's not a reactionary movement to the ball, but there should be a continuation of rotation. So let me do a little bit faster, playing the swing film in my mind. Okay. Again, you're not supposed to worry about the perfection of a contact or impact how far. You just want to make sure you're able to continuously rotate through the ball, like what I'm doing right now, right? Okay, again, a lot of you will do a double movement, means a double tick, means you will react you're creating an extension movement with your arms independently or chest muscle that's reacting to the ball. Those are not good because that's when you will create a double take, means you will start to worry about impact. So this time I'm going to do a little bit faster. I'm playing my swing film in my mind. Right there. This is very, very important, actually. I believe the human mind doesn't understand to differentiate between the impact from the hit and the impact from the actual swing. So you have to really work on it. Again, you can always hit the ball and play golf, but you always go, how come I'm never consistent? But the only way you have any type of consistency is that you have to make sure you understand what it feels like to play this swing film in your mind and swing through the ball. Okay, let's do one more. Okay, swing film in your mind. Play that very slowly, very slowly. Now remember, if you don't know how to do everything slow, then you will not know how to do everything correctly that's fast. You have to learn how to walk before you know how to run. So this is what I mean by create your own golf swing film. Not pictures, not positions, but a continuation of emotion where there's no reaction to the ball. All right, so if you guys have any questions, leave a comment. And uh, don't forget to click like and subscribe to our channel. Click on the notification button and also have two recommended videos if you want to know more about Energy First Impact later. And by the way, um, yesterday was our one year anniversary of our academy. That's um, from the day when we opened. All right. Thank you for your support. I will see you next time.